Welcome to the first Oregon Qualifying Tournament Awards and Closing Ceremony for First Tech Challenge Ultimate Goal, presented by Qualcomm. As you've experienced, FIRST is a community of global citizens. We're more than just an organization. We're a family, a movement, a culture for participants and volunteers and supporters. Programs like FIRST Tech Challenge are essential for creating scientists and innovators. This generation of scientists and innovators and the next are truly the key to saving the world and we must do all we can to believe in them by preparing and celebrating them. Let's celebrate our outstanding day we've had and our incredible participants. Before we hand out our awards, let's thank the awesome people who made this event happen. Today could not have been possible without our volunteers. Please say thanks in the chat for all the volunteers who have given their time effort, dedication, and so much more to champion the game and make this program a success. And another big round of applause for our generous sponsors, our first Game Changers powered by Star Wars for Force for Change season sponsor Disney and Lucasfilm, the Ultimate Goal season presenting sponsor Qualcomm, and our official program sponsor Collins Aerospace. Thank you so much. And now for the awards. First, we have a judge's award. The judge's award is given at the discretion of judges to a team they have encountered whose unique efforts, performance, or dynamics merit recognition, yet the team does not fit into any of the existing award categories. The judges in League E and F had this to say about one team. This team does what we've not seen. Their endgame score, a six ring supreme, atop the wobble, over the wall. Wow, what a team. Scored six rings on top of the wobble consistently. The judges award is presented to 12180 Robots Anonymous. Next up, the Control Award, sponsored by Arm Inc celebrates the team that demonstrates innovative thinking in the control system to solve game challenges, such as autonomous operation, enhancing mechanical systems with intelligent control, or using sensors to better achieve results on the field. The winner of the control award in leagues A and B is 8610 Tobor Tech. The winners of the control award in leagues E and F is 6564 Infinity Angles. Next, we have the Motivate Award. The team that receives the Motivate Award has the culture of first and clearly shows what it means to be a team. This award celebrates the team that represents the essence of the first tech challenge competition through team building, team spirit, and displayed enthusiasm. This is a team who makes a collective effort to make FIRST known throughout their school and community and sparks others to embrace the culture of FIRST. The winner of the Motivate Award in Leagues A and B is 14384 Formula R. The winner of the Motivate Award in Leagues C and D is 16438 Pulsar. And the winner of the Motivate Award in leagues E and F is 11170 RAM.exe. The Design Award expands on this year's challenge, inspiring teams to incorporate industrial design into their robots. These elements can be shown in the simplicity of the design as it applies to the task the look and feel of the robot and how the design allows us to think of robots in new ways. The design aspect must serve a function, but they should also differentiate the robot in a unique fashion. The winner of the design award in leagues A and B is 8404 Quicksilver. The winner of the design award in leagues C and D 
is 9339 Frog Force Robotics. The winner of the design award in leagues E and F is 16404 Riptide Robotics. The Collins Aerospace Innovate Award celebrates a team that has the ingenuity and inventiveness to make their designs come to life. This award is given to the team that the judges feel has the most innovative and creative robot design solution to the first Tech Tech Challenge game. Elements of this award include elegant design, robustness, and out-of-the-box thinking with regard to design. This award may address the design of the robot as a whole or some sub-assembly component of the robot. The creative component needs to work consistently, but a robot does not have to work all the time during matches to be considered for this award. The team's engineering notebook showed the design of the components and the team's robot, and clearly explains how the team arrived at their solution. The winner of the Collins Aerospace Innovate Award in Leagues A and B is 12216 APT. The winner of the Collins Aerospace Innovate Award in Leagues C and D is 7875 MIG. And the winner of the Collins Aerospace Innovate Award in League E and F is 10332 Technical Difficulties. The Connect Award is presented to the team that the judges feel most connected with their local science, technology, engineering, and math community. A true first team is more than the sum of its parts and recognizes that engaging their local STEM community plays an essential part in their success. The recipient of this award is recognized for helping the community understand FIRST, the FIRST Tech Challenge, and the team itself. In addition, the team that is recognized by this award aggressively seeks and recruits engineers and explores the opportunities available in the world of engineering, science, and technology. The winner of the Connect Award in League A and B is 18119, mostly operational. The winner of the Connect Award in League C and D is 12693, Wally. And the, connect, the winner of the Connect Award in Leagues E and F is 18446, Prisma. The Think Award is given to the team that the judges feel best reflects the journey of the engineering design process. The Engineering Notebook is the key reference for judges to help them identify the most deserving team. This team's engineering notebook focused on the design and build stages of the team's robot and exemplified their journey as a team in engineers. The winner of the Think Award in Leagues A and B is 12808 Rev Amped Robotics. The winners of the Think Award in Leagues C and D is 16433 Quasar. And the winner of the Think Award in League E and F is 187 Phoenix. And on to the Performance Awards. This award recognizes teams for their achievement in robot game performance. The Performance Award for League A and B goes to 12808 Revamped Robotics. The Performance Award for League C and D goes to 8176 Steelhead. And the Performance Award for League E and F goes to 16404 Shattered Carbide. The Inspire Award is presented to the team that the judges felt truly embodied the challenge of First Tech Challenge program. The team that receives this award is a strong ambassador for FIRST programs and works to promote FIRST and make it loud in their community. 
The team that receives this award has performed well in all judging categories and was chosen by the judges as a model first tech challenge team, both on and off the playing field. This team shares their experiences, enthusiasm, and knowledge with other teams, sponsors, their community, and the judges. Working as a unit, this team will have shown success in performing the task of designing and building a robot. The judges use observations made during interviews, the team's engineering notebook, and performance on the playing field in determining the winner. The winner of the Inspire Award in Leagues A and B is 18219 Primitive Data. The winner of the Inspire Award in League C and D is 8176 Steelhead. And the winner of the Inspire Award in League E and F is 11397 BBIT. Congratulations, teams. Finally, we want to announce who will be moving on to the state championships. If you see your team name and number on the screen, congratulations. You'll be hearing from ORTOP as the next steps to get you ready for the Oregon State Championships, which will take place on May 1st. Thank you all for being a great audience today, bringing your gracious professionalism to the event and supporting the next generation of innovators and game changers. And thank you to everyone today for making this a fun and excellent competition. We hope to see you all tuning into the state championships and our two special events leading up to it. Lead coaches, watch your emails and Discord for more information about our hangout with the Bearded Builders a chat with Portland's own Lego Masters, and a chat with the folks behind Big Dreams and Umatilla with a movie screening. Thank you again. See you next time. <laughs>